This guide shows you how to install or reinstall those classic Windows 7 games on Windows 10 or even Windows 8 or 8.1. This is also quite handy if you've just received a major update on Windows 10 and it's wiped the games out, so it shows you how to reinstall them. These games such as Spider Solitaire, Solitaire, Purple Place, Minesweeper, Mahjong Titans, Hearts, Free Cell and Chess Titans are all included in this guide. All you need to do is open your web browser. Now you can open any web browser with the exception of Internet Explorer as Internet Explorer is old, outdated and probably won't work with this guide anymore. So you can choose Brave Browser, Firefox, Opera, Chrome or Microsoft Edge. Now in this example, I'm gonna show you how to do this in Microsoft Edge. So you should have Microsoft Edge installed on Windows 10 by now. So just double click on the Microsoft Edge icon that looks like this. And then when Microsoft Edge has opened, go to the address bar right at the very top of the screen, not the search box in the middle of the screen, the address bar right at the very top, click into it and delete out anything that might be in there. And then you need to type archive.org forward slash download forward slash win seven games for win one zero eight eight one v2 just as it's shown here please ensure that you've also included the capital w the capital g the second capital w and the capital v so it is case sensitive so that's archive.org forward slash download capital w i n 7 capital g a m e s the number four capital w i n one zero eight eight one capital V two then press enter or return on your keyboard you should then see this screen appear now go down to where it says win seven games for win ten underscore eight underscore eight one underscore v2 dot iso and just move your mouse over where it's got view contents there left click on view contents then move your mouse over windows 7 games for windows 10 and 8.exe and left click once you should then see in the bottom left hand corner of the screen windows 7 games .xc downloading. Now this bit might take a bit of time because it is quite a large file and the server at times can sometimes be very slow. So please be patient with it, just let it run. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause this video and we're gonna come back to it once it's nearly finished downloading. Wow, that took some time. So there you go, it's uh, finished downloading, it's now scanning for viruses. All we need to do is move our mouse over Win7 Games there in the bottom left hand corner of the screen and left click once. Now if you've used a different browser, then what you can do is you can close down your browser, go to any yellow folder, either that one there, or you can click on the start button there and go to the documents folder just there, and then go into downloads just there and then double left click on Windows 7 games for Windows 10 and 8. And now hopefully whatever method you've chosen, we should all be at the same point. So it says, do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Well, make sure that it says there Windows 7 games for Windows 10 and 8.exe. If it does, then move your mouse over yes and left click once. Now. It may pause here for a little while and you might not see anything on your screen. That can be quite normal for some people. So it asks you now to select a language. So uh, I'm gonna select English and click OK. And this is it, this is the point where it seems to, the windows seem to disappear for a while and it looks like nothing's happening. But trust me, it's all happening in the background, so just be patient with it. And here we go, so it says, welcome to the Windows 7 games for Windows 10 and 8 Setup Wizard. So move your mouse over next and left click once. Now, it's asking us to select the components to install. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna untick internet games because internet games just simply don't work anymore. Microsoft have unplugged the server now, so there's no point in installing them because they won't work anyway. So just move your mouse over the little tick just to the left of internet games and left click once 
and that will stop them from being installed. Then move your mouse over, install, left click once, and they will now start to install. Now again, this bit might take a bit of time on some systems, just be patient with it. Then move your mouse over the box just to the left of Discover WinAero Tweaker to tune up Windows 10, 8.1 and 8, and just get rid of that tick. So left click on the box once. Then move your mouse over Finish, and again, left click once. So I'm just gonna shut whatever boxes I've got open down and then I click on the start button there and then we should see, if I scroll down there, games. If you click on games and there you go, there's all your games down there. And to open any one of them, you just click on the uh, left mouse button and uh, they will open. And if you found that uh, during the last update of Windows 10, you lost your games, then hopefully they'll reinstall by the same method and uh, hopefully if you're in the middle of the game, then uh, it should save your game. So there you go. I hope this guide helped you install or reinstall your classic Windows 7 games. Thank you very much for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech. That's at CWTech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.